Police body cam video shows us what officers encountered when they were called to a Mesquite charter school last week about a student with a gun. Three officers shot and wounded the student after police say he pointed a handgun at them in a shooting stance and ready to fire. Fox Sports Alex Boyer has an update on the police investigation. Alex. Hey guys, and after this investigation is complete, it will be referred to the Dallas County District Attorney's Office for review. Now, the DA, of, of course, is doing its own independent review and investigation. So is the Internal Affairs Unit here at Mesquite Police. That dramatic encounter captured both on school security and body camera video. February 19th at 8.49 a.m., Mesquite Police received a 911 call from an assistant principal at Pioneer Technology and Arts Academy Charter School, Oates Campus. She calmly explained that a student was in her office with a gun in his hands, refusing to put it down. I am with him. He's fine. I'm calming him down. I need to get someone here now. Okay, I'm getting him started. It's, where is he right now? He's in my office in room 151 in the building. I'm putting the building on lockdown. Two minutes later, the first Mesquite police officer arrives on scene. Another officer arrives shortly after, and the two make their way to the office. They find the assistant principal standing in the doorway and urge her to move away. The 16-year-old male student is in her office alone, sitting on a couch, a handgun at his feet. Soon after, a third Mesquite police officer arrives on scene. Police edited the video before its release, but tell us officers spoke calmly with the student for approximately four minutes. What, what's going on today, buddy? Can you talk to us? We would like to help you. That's why we're here. Can you listen to me closely? Please do not reach for that gun, okay? We don't want anything to happen to you or anyone else. That's when, according to Mesquite Police, the student reaches quickly for the handgun on the floor. One officer fires at the suspect. We just need you to step away, so we... The office door begins to close. The officer grabs the handle, pulling it open to maintain a visual inside the room. We can see the student is now standing. Police say he's facing the officers with the handgun raised towards them in a shooter's stance. The three officers fire at the student, injuring him in the leg. <laughs> Police say officers fired 19 shots in all. The student stayed inside the room until complying with commands to exit. He was taken into custody and treated for his injuries. A 38 caliber revolver was recovered by investigators. The responding units obviously understood the, the, the type of danger that they were facing at the time that they showed up. Dr. Alex Del Carmen is a criminologist who watched the body camera and school security video. He says the officers appeared to follow their training, first talking calmly to the gunman. We just want you to put the gun down and keep it down and walk to us and talk to us. And so it's a very much a de-escalating type of situation and only fired at the suspect when that didn't work. So there's clearly going to be violence at that point. Uh, they know that there's a, a lethal threat against the individual and others around them and also against the officers. So they have to engage in lethal force. And the suspect's name, who is not being released because he is a minor, continues to be held at the Dallas County Juvenile Justice Center. He is charged with multiple counts of aggravated assault against a public servant, as well as exhibition of a firearm.